Welcome to STAB exam forum. We have come up with another video on let's solve PYQ and in this video we are going to solve ISRO assistant exam that was held on 12 October 2014 okay 2014 and the section which we will cover will be general intelligence and reasoning ability okay so without uh, wasting any time let's begin the session I request all the students who are present here as well as those who are watching online uh, just try to give the answer and your time has already started yes time's up student the question says how many meaningful words that can be formed using letter A C R S using each letter once in each word okay so you need to form the meaningful English words okay so let's uh, uh, making this meaningful words so first meaningful word that can be formed from this letter will be cars okay and the second one you can make is uh, arcs a r c s third a word you can make is scar s c a r okay so these are the three words that uh, we can form from these letters so option b is the correct answer okay let's solve the next question and your time starts now student this question is from the logical reasoning okay and time's up okay so let's solve this question so blueberries cost more than strawberries okay so blueberries cost more than strawberries blueberries cost less, less than raspberry okay so blueberries cost less than raspberries okay raspberry cost more than uh, both strawberry and blueberry okay so question says if first two statement are true the third statement is what is it true is it false uncertain or data inadequate okay so just you need to combine these two statement how can you combine it will be like this blueberry is greater than strawberry and since blueberry is less than raspberry so you can write this okay so third statement raspberries cost more than strawberries and blueberries will be definitely true okay so if statement one and statement two is true then definitely statement three will be true so answer will be option a true okay option a true will be the correct answer okay coming to the next question student this question was in question paper but this question is invalid why because no equation is given okay so some equation should be given having plus minus multiply then you can answer this question so this question is invalid in that paper okay let's see the next question and your time starts now student this question category is called logical order okay logical order of words okay logical order of words okay so let's solve this question student uh, these are the four words you need to make a proper sequence okay so student this uh, word are some uh, related to meeting okay so in meeting first what will happen the arrival of parties comes okay so it start with option 3 okay 3 and after arrival there will be some introduction okay 3 5 so let's eliminate few of the options so option 1 and option 4th option A and option D are eliminated so we are left with option B and C so after introduction there will be presentation okay so 3 5 1 so we are left with option C and if we move forward then what happens then there will be discussion on that topic after that finally there will be some recommendation so option C is the correct answer so those those students who have given their answer is option 3 they are right okay so let's solve the next question and your time starts now time's up student this question is from analgy analgy plus 
coding decoding okay this is a combination of the question okay analogy and coding decoding okay so uh, this word is coded as this so you need to uh, code that uh, similar pattern with this word think okay so let's first find out what is the encryption form for this word reason okay so how this uh, reason is encrypted let's see s f b t p o okay so as you clearly say sees that r s e f a b s t o p n o so there is plus one uh, alphabet is increased for each letter so similarly if you increase each letter by one you will have your answer so t u h i i j n and what n will become o k l so u i j o l student uh, this is wrong uh, option 2 is misprinted okay it is u i j o l okay as you can see uh, u i s s cannot be there because after i you will have j so option b is the right answer okay it is u i j o l okay quickly moving to the next question it is from the calendar and your time starts now times up student this is this question is from the calendar a very simple question okay so sneha correctly remembers kiran birthday was after tuesday and before friday so let's make a diagram for that after tuesday and before friday okay so her birthday will be in between raman correctly remember that kiran's birthday was after wednesday okay so after wednesday but before sunday okay so here is sunday so we will have a range of this much okay so it 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 is before friday and after wednesday so there is one day left what is that thursday okay so and thursday is the correct answer for this question okay so thursday is the day on which kiran's birthday fell okay so option b is the correct answer quickly moving to the next question it is again from the logical reasoning the question that we have seen on raspberry and strawberry okay so let's uh, make the statement for this so apartment in riverdale manor cost less than apartment in gaslight commons okay so what we can write r is less than g r stand for riverdale manor and g stand for gaslight common similarly apartment in liverstone is greater than is more than gaslight commons okay so just combine these two what will you get r is less than g and less than l so if first two statement are true the third statement is uh what is the third statement o out of three um, apartment building living stain gate cost the most okay so as you can see this living stain gate cost the most okay uh, so option a will be the correct why because if you have two uh, statement are true then definitely third statement will also be true okay so we have deduced that third statement is true so option a is the correct answer okay quickly coming to the next question it is again from the coding decoding again from the coding decoding okay you can practice accordingly so let's solve it student as you can see the word play is coded as t p e c t p e c okay so what is the relation between them Let, let's uh, find out the positional difference p q r s t so there is plus four letters l m n o p again after uh, adding plus four we have p again a b c d e and y 
z a b c so plus 4 so there is a increment of 4 for each a letter okay therefore for game what will be the answer g h i j k okay a b c d e m n o p q okay plus 4 e f g h i okay so answer is k e q i okay so option d is the correct answer okay let's see the next question and your time starts now it is from the sitting arrangement linear sitting arrangement and time's up student this question is from linear sitting arrangement linear sitting arrangement okay so let's draw a sequence for that five person are sitting in a row okay let's draw five person one two three four five Tarak is right of John okay so let's uh, make this Tarak Tarak is right of John okay Murli is to left of John okay Murli is left of John but to the right of Lalit okay but to the right of Lalit okay so this Murli this this Murli is uh, right of Lalit okay so this Murli is right of Lalit if Tarak is to left of Khurshid okay if Tarak is left of Khurshid so this is Khurshid and Tarak is left of Khurshid uh, so this is uh, gone okay so we have five percent so what he is saying who is at the extreme left so extreme left we have Lalit so option C is the right answer okay so option C is the right answer okay let's see the next question and your time starts now again this question is from coding decoding coding decoding okay let's solve it so the word is gardener g a r d n e r okay so how it is coded f b q e okay this much is sufficient so f g means uh, uh, we are decrementing one letter before g what comes f and here we are incrementing a b here we are decrementing r by one then it become q again here we are incrementing so there is a pattern of minus one plus one and say so on okay so what will be the uh, coded form for dramatic drama test okay let's have this much word only okay so d what come yes c because we need to subtract first then we need to add r s so we can state um, away eliminate these two option so next what is a so we need to decrement by one so we get z okay so again option one is eliminated so we are left with option b and option b is the correct answer okay you need not to go further just a few later you can look okay so option b is the right answer coming to the next question and your time starts now okay student this question is from order and ranking order and ranking okay J let's see the question so in a row of boy rajan is 10th from the right okay this is the right so rajan is 10th from the right okay and suraj is 10th from the left so suraj is 10th from the left this is suraj and this is rajan now what happens they interchange their posi position and suraj will be on 27th okay so suraj is now shifted on 27th okay so previously he was in 10th now he is on 27th okay this is 10th so as you can see what is the difference between 27 and 16 how many people will be there 27 minus 10 uh, what will be the answer yes 16 okay 
so what they are asking which of the following will be rajan position so rajan will be if if we need to from the right okay we need to find out from the right so previously his position was 10th so we need to add 10 to this 16 okay because the difference uh, between these two is 16 and if we uh, add 10 so we get the position from the right okay and uh, plus one position why it is required because one we are uh, excluding it for it that okay so the answer is 27 okay so option d 27 is the right answer okay quickly moving to the next question i think this is the last question student student uh, this question is very simple so what uh, uh, question says if in each number first and last digit are interchanged which will be the third highest number okay so let's interchange first and last so if we interchange first and last digit what will be the number 279 it will become 286 it will become 981 it will become 892 third highest means first this is the first highest this is the second highest third highest will be option b okay so option b is the correct answer okay so let's move to the next question and your time starts now student you need to find the next number okay here after 61 what should be the answer okay so as you can see 5 to jet 10 13 to jet 26 okay so here he is adding plus 3 10 plus 3 13 so 26 plus 3 29 so uh, 29 multiplied by 2 is 58 then again adding 2 then it should be multiplied with uh, sorry difference is 3 and it should be multiplied with 2 so 61 2 ja 122 okay so option a is the correct answer okay a very simple one coming to the next question let's begin the timer student this question is from the direction sense test okay this question is from direction okay so let's make a diagram so the person is facing east so he is facing in this direction then i turn 100 uh, degree in clockwise so this is clockwise this is 90 so this is 100 degree so he turned like this after that he turned 145 degree in anti-clockwise direction okay so as you know this is uh, 90 okay and this is 10 100 and 145 this much is 45 degrees so total this angle is 145 degree anti-clockwise so now he is facing in this direction what is this direction this is north this is east northeast is the answer okay so option b is the correct answer let's uh, go to the next question student this question is from the uh, is, is for you for the homework okay so just tell me the answer in the comment box okay so thank you for watching and we have another videos on previous year questions so we have solved journal knowledge and english language and the slavers discussion we have already done that okay so if you are interested in watching those video you can watch and enhance your knowledge thank you for watching and have a nice day